What's up YouTube? Back for another one. This one is on another soda from Japan. The last one I did was a melon cream which was good but I failed to mention that video. I think I mentioned it, I don't know if it did or not but I mentioned now on this one. That that soda would have been better if it had like a melony flavor to it. Instead of it just straight cream, had like a melon flavor to it. Like an orange bang or an orange whip type of flavor. For those of you who have that drink, you know what I'm talking about. For those of you that don't, go try that drink out and you'll know what I'm talking about. But in this one, it's another, another product of Japan. And this one is called Grape Ramu Bottle. And uh, that's what it looks like. This glass bottle. I had in this bottle before. But it's been a while, so I forgot what it tastes like. But it is this bottle. Right here, if you guys could pause it, if you guys can see it. It does say, Product of Japan. So you guys know I'm not pointing on his leg. And it does have Japanese right in the bottle, so... Yeah, it has all that. It has a, a warning label, which... I didn't see on the last bottle, so it says warming. Consume this product can expose you to bis head, which is known in the state of California to cause birth defects, other respiratory respiratory harm. So yeah, it has that. <laughs> Again, you guys read the ingredients right there where it says products of Japan. It has the ingredients. You guys want to pause it right here to read it. That's cool with me. But, yeah. The bottle is pretty cool and it's better than the other one. I'll give the bottle a 50 out of 100. You know, it's a pretty cool bottle. I like it. So, let's get into the... So drink, it says sangria if you guys have noticed it, so let's get into it. Definitely smell the grape. Smell like Robotub Robotuzin, to tell you the truth. Can hear the sizzle, I don't know if you guys can hear it or not. I don't know if y'all can hear it, but you can hear the sizzling. Well, Robitussin. Well, let's try it and see how it tastes. Cheers. It definitely has a grape soda taste to it. Slightly tastes like, like I said, Robitussin. Slightly has a Robitussin taste to it, but it's actually not that bad. You know, it, it's good. I, I'll... I might buy this again, but I'm not too quite sure about it. <sighs> Flavor wise, it's good. But like I said, it just has that robot system taste to it. I will give it. I'll give it a 32 out of 100. Or a 30 out of 100. You know, it tastes like robot carbonated robot if it tastes like a regular grape soda like they sell here in the United States, it'll be better. But it has that taste to it, so it kind of throws it off a little bit. But, uh, yeah, the bottle, like I said, I give it 100. Not 100, but the bottle, I give it a 50. I think it'd be better if it had, you know, aluminum. But had like this to open it. You got pressed down to open it. That'll make this bottle more badass. Yeah, there I'll buy one to save and one one to save when to drink. Yeah. Yeah. But uh bottle I'll give it a fifty. The drink I'll give it a thirty. Overall score I'll give it I'll give it a fifty five out of hundred overall. You know, it needs to taste more like grape soda instead of Robitussin. So, yeah. Well, that's it for me, ladies and gentlemen. I will be back. 
Don't know when. I'm not going to say when. But I'll be back soon to review an Italian cream soda. And I had Italian cream soda before from a restaurant. But never from the bottle. So, well, that will be interesting to see how it goes. So, yeah. Keep a lookout for that video. And I'll see you in my next one. But until then, take care. God bless.